And on to sports news, Kariobangi Shark striker Eric Kapaito has scored 14 goals in the FKF Premier League this season. Despite the club's absence in the top four so far, Kapaito is hopeful that his club will fight for the league title upon resumption of football in the country. Ahmed Bahaj reports. The 2018 Kenya Premier League Golden Boot winner Eric Kapaito is unstoppable in the 2020-2021 season. He has bagged 14 goals in 15 matches for Kariobangi Sharks and he is geared to score more when the league resumes. Ah ni kujipush kabisa ukiangalia venye na work na team yetu pia. Wase kila siku tuki train tunajipush kabisa. Alafu hiyo extra tunapiga sana unaona. Alafu sasa ukiangalia kama team yetu sasa tumejail vizuri na wachezaji wote. After being sidelined with a long-term knee injury in 2019, Eric's main target is to help Kariobangi Sharks win the Football Kenya Federation League for the first time in their history. 16 goals nilikuwa nayo ile season ingine. Iyo ndiyo plan yangu kwanza. Kifika 16 nasa ianze kuongezeka pia itakuwa tu ni buwana. So mali ntafikia, ntashukuru mungu. Nata kusaidia pia team to at least to pateate iyo kikombe kuzi. With an outstanding goal scoring form at his club, Eric was named in the Harambe Stars lineup during the 2022 Afghan qualifiers, where he scored in a 2 1 build up match against Tanzania. However, he failed to feature against Egypt after picking up an injury. Kuchaza national team kwa zinajua tuko wengi, imagine Kenya mzima wachezaji venye ni wengi, then umechaguliwa ku represent the country naona naweza sema ili kuwa poa ala mekuwa na performance poa so naweza urge to my players wenzangu tuendele tu na hiyo effort to na make at least cause ni kitu tunaweza fanya kama national team na na believe venye team iko venye wachezaji wana jipush hard na technical bench yote venye ina work na believe tunaweza toka na kitu poa sana with his Kariobangi Sharks contract ending this year, rumors indicate that several clubs in and out of the country are seeking for his signature at the end of the season. Because around na watu wenye wanaanisaidia kwa kila kitu imambo ya ball. So time of a point akuja then move to Tamik. Ah, siko sure but uh, venye tu ita come, I believe tu mungu wana reason yaki ya kila kitu. So I believe tawaktu na the best thing for me. Ahmed Bahaj. KTN Sports. Thank you, Bahaj, for that story. Now, national boxing tactician Benjamin Musa has guaranteed that the Eindhoven Cup boxing tournament will be a key boost for the national team ahead of the Olympics. The tournament set for Poland from the 20th of May will give the team a scope of understanding more so in what they should expect in the Olympics. Mashindano hayo pia ni muhimu sana manake tutakuwa tunazidi kujipima nguvu na kunoa makali kwa wale mabondia ambao wamefuzu kuenda kwa mashindano ya olimpiki. Na, naeza kuambia wa Kenya wenzangu kwamba sisi tunataka kuenda pale ku, ku, kujipatia, kupatia our best shot mashindano haya ya olimpiki. Tunataka tuende to perform katika kiwango ambao ina starajiwa na kama kwa uwezo wetu uh, uwezo wake Mwenyezi Mungu target ni at least kufika uh, the podium hiyo itakuwa ni uh, matokeo mazuri zaidi kwetu uh, so hiyo ndio kazi ambayo tunawaka so, tunawaka na tunaona kwamba tuna uwezo huo uh, kulingana na wale wachezaji tuko nao tuna uwezo wao wa, wa kuperform vizuri Turns out it's the Eindhoven Cup Boxing Tournament. And on that note, I'd like to wish you a lovely night ahead. My name is Trix Ingado. Our sign language and